hey friends welcome back to my channel today i'm going to show you top five plugins that would make your design stand out friends let's just get into it okay So the first on my list is Magic Copy AI Text Generator. Friends, one thing you need to stop doing is using lorem text on your designs, okay? This makes your designs look so unprofessional, but the good news is you don't have to worry about this anymore because Magic Copy solves this problem. Let's see how this works, okay? So here I have a screen with some lorem dummy text, but let's quickly transform this with some relevant copy so i'll duplicate click on the text layer right click go to plugins so i already have the magic copy plugin installed but if you don't then just go to find more plugins and install okay so select magic copy here you can select the industry product or company name copy type and even the language this is amazing guys amazing stuff then click on generate copy and there you go some great headline for your design i can also generate some subtitle text so i'll repeat the process click on text layer select subtitle and generate copy and just like that your design is more meaningful and professional okay okay so the next on my list is color contrast checker you guys if you want to be a good designer then you have to design for accessibility and this means your designs have to be easy to use for everyone regardless of physical impairments or challenges one way to do this is you need to make sure there is enough contrast between your colors and text a11 white color contrast checker can help you with this let's see how this works okay so here I have a frame with some text. I'll select the frame one, right click, go to plugins. I already have this installed, but if you don't, then select find more plugins instead. I'll go ahead and select A11 white color contrast checker, click check, and we have some problems right here, guys. My design clearly fills the text to background color contrast ratio. To understand this better, I'll advise you do some research on WCAG rules, but let's go ahead and adjust the text lightness until we get the green checks. I really love this plugin because it doesn't just give you recommendations, but it also does the color adjustments for you. So I can select my second frame to check this, and this is amazing, all clear. So great contrast ratio. Okay, moving on. The third plugin on my list is Remove BG plugin. This one's been really helpful to me because sometimes you're working on designs and you just don't need that background. You know what I mean? And I have a video on how to remove backgrounds for complex images, but for simple images, the Remove BG plugin is just fine. Let's see how this works, okay? So I have this image, all I have to do is right click, plugins, select remove BG plugin and run. And image background is removed. So really easy to use you guys. Okay, so the fourth on my list is blush. You guys, I love this plugin. And this in my opinion is one of the best plugins for illustrations. But let's see how this works, okay? So like before, I'll select the frame, right click, go to plugins. I already have this plugin installed, but if you don't, then select find more plugins instead. I'll go ahead and select blush, click search, select education category, make a selection, and there you have it. Amazing stuff, you guys. And the fifth on my list is content reel. Content Reel has been around like forever, but in my opinion, it's still very much essential, especially when you are designing and you need placeholder text, images, icons, name it. It's also very easy to use. So here I have a table and I need some dummy text. And as always, I'll right click, plugins, 
content reel. Let's say I need some real names and there you have it, okay? So there you go guys, my top five plugins. I actually have top 10 plugins, but I've made this video into a two part series so you can catch my next top five list in the next video, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'm so happy you're here and I appreciate every one of you. I hope my videos are helpful to you. Please like, please subscribe, please turn on notifications so I can bring you amazing content every single week. Thank you so much and I'll see you in the next one, okay? Bye!